Yuji Hanma is the most romantic and the best father in the world. He is also the most powerful and masculine creature in the world. Yuji Hanma is so masculine that if he attends a feminist rally, he comes back with his shirt ironed and a sandwich in his hand. He is so masculine that when he takes a taxi, driver pays him and when you invite him to your house, you are the guest. He is so masculine that he has never cooked a single meal in his life. Yuji Hanma was born in the 1950s and he came out of his mother's womb after being 3 months old. were there unlike you weakling staying there for 9 months yes he himself wanted to come out of his mother's womb and his body at that time was harder than any man on this earth in fact i won't be one surprised if yujiro as a sperm cell waited for rest of the sperm cells and then killed them thus being the only survivor after coming to this world yujiro drank all of his mother's milk he drank so much milk that his mother had to leave this cute boy and later she becomes a monk Anyways, Yujiro somehow survived, but he was really skinny, and his father Yujiro was just too busy being badass. In his childhood days, he always wished to be as powerful as the dinosaurs, but he was out of luck because he wanted to be a millionaire, but his father was a trillionaire. Anyways, when he grew up, he knew he can't always stay at home, so he got out and started working as a paid mercenary because he wanted to gain experience and obviously needed money to eat hundred thousand calories and drink ten coca. colas every single day later when he was in vietnam he met dain at the battlefield dain was impressed by yujiro and even called him a cute boy but yujiro handled the situation like a gentleman i could peel your skull like an orange right now if i wanted to I am the boss here but since you are cute and one of the only women in my universe you can follow me but after some time Dain showed her true colors and betrayed Yujiro in return Yujiro raped her which left Dain traumatized 9 months later Dain gave birth to Jack Hanma and then she became a monk as well after this Yujiro started roaming the world doing a lot of things like defeating USA learning other martial arts kicking fighters ass and kicking fighters ass but after some time he realized that he wanted a strong enemy So he went to a party, found a girl named Emi Akizawa, looked at her with his sexy eyes. After which Emi Akizawa fell in love with Yujiro, but his husband was against it. So Yujiro just killed her husband and said these golden words to her. I come to collect you. And then he cuts the crap and proceeds to the real talk. Look, I want a son named Baki so that I can have a good enemy to fight with. So you don't want to love me and just want to impregnate me so that later you can fight the boy I will give birth to? Yes. Okay, but what if I give birth to a female child? Don't worry. Masculinity of the Hanma blood can never produce a female child for 99.999% of the time. And if somehow a female Hanma gets born, Masculinity of the Hanma blood will change her gender. You don't believe me? Look at my chest. I'm so masculine that I don't even have nipples. After some time, Yujiro realized that he was nowhere near his father's tenth. It was then when he discovered about PP training. After that, he started doing the legendary PP training day and night. He didn't limit his PP training to just humans and produced a lot of hybrid Hanma animals like crocodile Hanma, gorilla Hanma, lion Hanma, polar bear Hanma, and ant Hanma. This 25 meter long crocodile was crocodile Hanma and this polar bear was polar bear Hanma. Now Yujiro had some variety and could fight other creatures as well. Some of these Hanma creatures actually became so strong that we can even see them in other anime. Now a lot of you guys might be thinking that how did he do it with an ant? The answer is pretty simple. By doing the PP training with a lot of animals, his PP got smaller and smaller. At the end of PP training, he finally lost his PP thus giving him the unimaginable amount of power and making him immune to the art of kicking the nuts after getting so much power yujiro started roaming the world and started doing the only thing he knew beating other fighters as this thing continued for years until baki turned 13 after baki turned 13 yujiro for some reason thought that baki was a perfect opponent to fight and told him that he will fight him in one month and after one month yujiro visits emi and after meeting him for the first time in years this women just wanted to love yujiro You should think about other things. I am no longer an option for you anymore. What he really meant. Now nah, which I don't have my PP with me. Then the next day Baki was like my father has defeated USA. So what? I still have a chance. It was then when the legendary earthquake came. Yeah. 
Chill bro, I just work here. Then the fight started and this fight was really balanced and intense, at least for Baki. Thank you for coming. This seems like a good time to talk. I'm pleased with this turnout and that my son is- But Baki's mother joined the fight and Yujiro hugged her. He hugged her a little too hard. After this, Yujiro kicks everybody else's ass, tells them how garbage they are and leaves. Typical Yujiro, he just comes out of nowhere, beats your ass and just disappears into thin air. Then for the next few years, Yujiro again starts doing the same thing, beating other fighters ass. After few years, he visits Maximum Tournament, a tournament which is held in a very long time, where the top punching bags and some warriors were participating. He didn't participate in the tournament because then it wouldn't be a tournament. So he just watched. But Yujiro's old habit of beating ass again overpowered his calmness and he started beating the ass of all fighters at once. But then a few people took him down with some darts and a net. And then they put him in a secure underground place with the hardest walls and doors. And let's just say there's no material on earth which is hard enough to stop a Hanma who has done his PP training. After opening the door, Yujiro meets Retsu and tells him that he may share Kaio's name and have the experience of 4000 years old Chinese martial arts. But Baki shares Hanma blood and have his demon bag that is older than time itself. After this he meets Jack Hanma and teaches him how to bite properly. Biting is just another type of fighting you can find on any battlefield. You have to make sure you hit the jugular vein like any good vampire. Then Yujiro continues to visit fighters, tell them how garbage they are, beat their ass and leave. Yujiro also keeps watching Baki at every point and when Baki finally was about to start his PP training, Yujiro comes out of nowhere, teaches him about the importance of PP training and just leaves. If you want to get stronger, do it. Morning, noon and night, do it. During this time, Yujiro also shows his secret technique, Demon Fart, where his demon farts at his hairs, thus making them fly. Later, Yujiro joins Raitai tournament where he does the only thing he knows, beating a lot of ass. His final match was with Kaku Kayo, a 146-year-old martial artist with the experience of 4,000 years of Chinese martial arts. He also had a son who was 26 year old. Old man himself did some PP training as well. Kakukayo fought Yujiro really well, so much that Yujiro even backed off for a moment. But then Yujiro unleashed his demon. And when Yujiro unleashes his demon, there is only one way you can survive, and that is by dying. So Kakukayo had to die to survive Yujiro. After the tournament was over, Baki challenges Yujiro for a final match. Of course, Yujiro accepts it and finally the day comes when Baki fought Yujiro. And this fight was and probably will remain the best fight in this anime. During this fight, Yujiro shows that even his veins have muscles. At the end of this fight, Yujiro declares Baki as the strongest creature even though Baki was the one laying almost dead on the ground. Hopefully this fight will be animated in 20 years. After this fight, Yujiro continues to roam the world and kick other fighters ass. Until this day, he is still doing the same. A fun fact about about Yujiro. Yujiro has trained his body to the point that he no longer has to poop because his body absorbs every single particle of the food he eats. I also have a discord server guys where we all can come up with even greater ideas, grow the Baki and overall anime community. Also through my discord server you guys can chat with me and suggest me new ideas or you can just talk about anime with other like minded anime fans and we can do a lot of other things on discord server which we cannot do on youtube. So if you are interested you can join the discord community by clicking the link in the description below. That's it for the video guys, hope you guys liked the video, if you did then you can like the video and subscribe the channel. Also don't forget to turn on the notifications bell and join the discord server, the link is in the description below.